Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make wheel rotating transition effect in After Effects. First of all you will need two clips with car wheels. Then we will need to mask out wheels on both clips. Let's duplicate first clip and rename it to wheel. To mask I will use Mocha AE. In Mocha select an elliptical tool and mask the wheel as smooth as possible. Once you are done, enable perspective and hit on tracking button. As the tracking is done, click on save and close Mocha AE. Expand mat now and enable apply mat. First clip is ready, now let's jump to another clip, simply do the same, duplicate your second clip and rename it to wheel 2 and then mask out it as well, I will skip it cause you already know how to do it. Once you are done and both masks are ready, we can begin making the effect. Scroll near to the end of your first clip and add CC radial blur effect on first wheel layer. Note, to make this effect you can use a twirl effect or simply keyframe rotation on wheel layer and you will get the same look, but I enjoy CC radial blur effect more. Click on center stopwatch icon and then move the anchor point to the center of the wheel. Scroll to the end of wheel layer and correct the anchor point, make sure to keep it centered. Now press U on your keyboard to open created keyframes, then scroll to the first keyframe and click on amount stopwatch icon. Change type to rotate and set the quality to 100. Go to very end of wheel layer now and change amount to around 10. First step is ready, let's jump to another wheel now. Select your second wheel layer and add CC radial blur here as well. At the beginning, click on center stopwatch icon to create a keyframe and then move the anchor point to the center of the wheel. Scroll forward a bit now and correct the anchor point. Press U to open created keyframes and then scroll to the beginning of that layer. Change type to rotate and then set the quality to 100. Click on amount stopwatch icon now and this time, we should make it minus 10. Scroll to the second keyframe and then change amount back to 0. Let's check the effect now. It's done and ready to be rendered. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.